All right, it's time to finally progress with the story here. I made my way to Sahasrara. Sir, the guards won't allow us to enter anymore. If we try, they kill us. What the hell's going on? Yeah, they do look kind of outfitted for something. All entry is forbidden. Leave now or face termination. No, get out of my way. Okay, we got temple guards here. Uh, well, let's just try... Okay, okay. Okay, that was a really good hit, actually. Oh. Maybe I should put something on heat so that he can actually attack. When we face these guards. If I manage to get a freeze on them, um, physical should work, but I feel like they're either resistant to freeze or I'm just getting very unlucky right now. He did get stunned though, the other one. So I definitely want to transform back. I'm not sure if that's a move that does more damage to human form. All right. Let's let's equip Heat with something useful. I do want to keep him there because I'm pretty sure we have more than just guards to fight. So, I could just give him either Mabufudine or Bufudine. Probably just Bufudine. And we can replace Rakaja. And we might as well just get Isaiah. Except critical. Found Sarah. Those without a code are not permitted to enter. Refusal to comply will result in termination. Stand down. Fail safe override confirmation. One without code has been recognized as Cyber Shaman. Welcome back, Mother. Surf and the others are coming. Do not let them pass. However, you are not permitted to kill them under any circumstances. Okay. This is not what it was supposed to happen. We're like the kings of the junkyard. They should bow to us. We're the kings now, yeah. They clearly don't want us to reach Nirvana. These probably aren't orders from the Karma Temple. You saw what Sarah was capable of. Hey, can you feel something inside of your head? Ever since I received the Atma, I can hear or feel it. 
It tells me that my true name is James Mason. I hate to ask you this, but can you do me a favor? If you find a girl named Amelia, I need you to tell her something for me. Thank you. Just tell her. Please be happy. That's all. Um, I'll try to remember, but there's a good chance I'm going to forget. Sarah said that she came to help us. Is that where she went? Is she going to accomplish what she came for? Alone? Let's go. Two mouths mean you'll be devoured twice as fast. All right. Let's not delay this any longer. We've we've delayed this for long enough with our side bosses. Okay. Has this Karma Temple always been here? I think it has, but it's been so long. Looks like we've reached over the 30 hour mark. And you're probably not gonna let me pass, are you? All entry is forbidden. Leave now or face termination. Get out of my way. You know what? It might be better to just use Arjula here instead of Heat. And yeah, it looks like that Impale is something that they use on human forms. Oh, finally! Okay. Let's actually use Surf, Gale, and Argilla for this part. So Heat, you can go ahead and have Mutual Karma. And then Argilla, I'm going to give you your Resist. Oh! Never mind. You've yet to learn your resist. Whatever, okay. We'll go with heat then. Yeah, well, we'll live with it. It's fine. that pillar in the middle 
on the top, there were upside down people. Like, just hanging there. Yeah. Look at that. It's the top halves of... Some demons, maybe? Oh, maybe it was always there. The dissemination machine. But, uh, Sarah's guards really did a good job holding me back. Isn't this more like Fallen? of milk. Welcome to the Samsara circulation system. A stage one process of repurifying discard information currently in progress. Information of destroyed Asuras will be recycled in the sea of milk. What is Asura? And what the hell does stage one mean? Sarah's probably going to risk her life or something for our sake. You can't let her do that. Well, Asura was the type of demon that we fought. So we enter this world fully developed. That explains the absence of children. These are unfinished humans. So the sea of milk is used to create us essentially okay what's this asuras with karma shall not enter the sea of milk that is the Cyber Shaman's will. Leave at once. Alright, boss time. Dragon Vasuki. Wow. That thing must have a really high chance of freezing. Alright, you're at minus four. I hope you have the Kaja. Oh wow, she is tanky. The fact that she took nothing from that, that's pretty impressive. Doesn't help that we both have ice right now.
Okay, well, even with her physical resistance, um, I feel like this is going to be a free win now. Because it doesn't look like she has Dakaja or anything. So I might as well just attack with Gale and have the other two restore my MP for later. Yeah, like we expected, we're probably extremely overleveled and overpowered for the rest of the game. Now that we've killed Beelzebub. So... I mean, to try to make it as hard as possible, I can skip all the random battles, which I've, I've done a lot already. But yeah, I don't think this guy has anything else. Okay, she's bloodied now. So this would be your chance to do something crazy. No, I think her gimmick was just to get freeze on everyone and then just keep hitting you for crits. And that's supposed to be enough to kill you. But well, when you're at minus four, it's kind of hard to do that. Enter the sea of milk from here. Okay, great. This is also a good chance to switch up our mantra a bit. I should probably switch it so that I don't have two people with ice. But honestly, Keats only... I only put ice on him so that he has something to do. And I doubt there's another ice boss. And his ice is way stronger than his fire, so... Whatever, we'll be fine. I should save, though. Elevation minus 492. Those look like Pazuzus, but we're not even going to bother with that. Because we got ambushed. And I might fight them once. Just to figure out their weaknesses and stuff. Yeah, I'll fight these guys once. And we'll see how deadly they are.
Okay, well, it looks like we could just physically attack them and we'll be just fine. Kind of like what we did at the beginning of the game when we had heat and only heat. I feel like bringing in Cielo just made things harder for myself. give that much karma so there's really no point okay oh good chance to try to show off how I kill these guys but so we have to pray that I either get a critical or he he does not run Or, I don't even need to get a critical anymore. Before I did, but I guess the new gun that I got from Beelzebub uh, raised my... raised my stuff high enough. Okay, let's just max out our strength. Man, our Jilla's stats are looking almost as imbalanced as mine. Um, maiden. I'm not. I'm not gonna go back. Okay, now I want to go back and check out the other side, because I think that's going to lead to the treasure. Okay, we got evil Rakshasas, who I believe are immune to physical. Okay, no, they reflect ice. You know what, they probably have super high counter attack. Or they could just have zero HP. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I think we're just gonna... We're gonna go back to the terminal. I'm gonna switch up the mantras and then I'm gonna end the episode there. And then next time, we will continue exploring... I'm assuming this is called the Sea of Milk or I guess Saha Rara Underground or whatever. Oh, we got temple guards. Cool. I don't want to fight you. Let's see if they have a name for me here. Uh, well, first, let's get him a mantra. We could give him Sakura Rage 2. Or we could... Yeah, let's go with this. It's a lot cheaper, too. And it looks like we're getting a lot of money from the mobs here, too. That's good. Or it could just be from the brain that I killed. No, it just says Karma Temple. Alright. Well, next time we're gonna go deeper 
or I guess it's not deeper. We're going higher into the Karma Temple. And we're going to see what lies ahead. And if we can reach Sarah or if she has a lot more guards than we expect. But until then, thanks for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.